Uh, this is how ladies end up not being married or not finding love. Uh, I'm going to drop you the video of those people you're seeing on the screen. Uh, as that lady in blue being rejected by all men uh, because she was finding love. And what, what was so disgusting? What was so... What made this woman be rejected? That's what you want, uh, I want to talk about. So if you look at this lady, really, uh, he has a picture. She, she has a picture of uh, MEI, you know. She has put on tattoos. And as you know, most people really regard tattoos to be for people who are by eye. And I think it was one of the, the reasons why this man rejected this lady. And also, if you, you look at the dressing code, you can even see hmm, no man would like to have a woman who puts on like that, a slit like that. Because it seems like she doesn't really respect herself. And you cannot present such a woman to the to your parents or to the friends because when you're dating it is very important also to to look at the dressing code of a woman if you find a woman like this putting on like this for the first time for the second time for the third time then you not don't expect her to change when you have married her uh, because whatever she does she does it oh that's her personality you look at the, the tattoos means there's tattoos means a lot a lot of bad things a lot so really men love ladies without tattoos uh, ladies who are natural don't like too much makeup ladies who dress decently so this woman was re rejected of having a lot of tattoos uh, not having a good uh, cord, I mean dressing cord. And lastly, <laughs> uh, they asked her, do you have children? She said, yeah, probably have three. That is really one of the things that is making ladies to stay single. So it is very important, ladies, if you get married, uh, you stick to one man because... No man will want to marry three or a woman with with children because the more children you have, the more responsibility it means to to that man. It means to that guy. It is not bad. I'm not against single mothers, but when you have children with you, it speaks a lot. Most when you have. Three children from different fathers. It it will make this man begin imagining what made you leave the other one, what made you leave this one also, what made you leave also the other one. So, it speaks a lot. It is better you keep yourself even if up the age of thirty without a kid, because you look responsible. Quote me, I'm not against single mothers, but. If you're married and you have children, stay where you are. Stop disturb, disturbing your peace. That, ah, uh, I even mean if I have children, I'll go out there and look for another man. I'll get another man. Let there be a general reason that takes you out there to look for another man. Uh, believe me or not, because. Most of you ladies, you have children that you don't even, you are able to take care of. Which means that this man will always be taking care of those children. And lastly, believe me or not, you will be still in connection with the father of the children. Whereby most men don't love that. Uh, they want you to be there. They want you to be there. You know? They want to be there full in your life, whereby children will not make you be there full in that man's 
life there will be always conflicts i'm going to see the father of the children this have been like this so there will be no general love so if you have the children please it is not a bad idea but learn how to behave character is very important so character is very important let me drop you the video and you can watch it you you guys <laughs> okay let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady hello welcome in i'll have you take that what's your name uh brianna brianna mm -hmm. how old are you i'm 29 and what do you do um i'm an entrepreneur okay do you have any businesses we could be on the lookout for? Uh, no, just not right now. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I'm a gamer, so I just more be to myself. Okay. Um, I'm a PC gamer, so I got like, I'm a gamer. That's all. Okay. <laughs> That's what I love to do for fun, to be honest. So. <laughs> all right. Um, and now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, a confident man, loyal. Um, I don't know. A man that really knows about himself, you know. Um, not really on career set, you know, just more of if he knows what he want to go for. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, just a confident man that knows how to treat a lady. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what are some deal breakers? Uh, a felon. Um, <laughs> um, I don't know. A judgmental man. I don't like nobody that just judge, you know, off of appearance or anything like that. Mm -hmm. So, okay. that's really it. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right. So, we did get a few pop balloons. Mm -hmm. Let's go on over there see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, let's start here with your name and age. How you doing? Uh, my name is Ishama. I'm 37. Okay. And Ishama, why did you end up popping your balloon? I apologize. It was the tattoos that caught oh, me, yeah. and I'm just not a mm. fan of too much oh, tattoos and stuff like that. I, even though I have tattoos myself, mm -hmm. it's just like, yeah, it was just a little too you're much, good. but gorgeous yourself, though. Thank you. No problem. Mm -hmm. Now, is, is Ishama someone that's your type? You're not bad looking. Appreciate that. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age? Ricky, and I'm 32. Nice to meet you. And Ricky, why did you end up popping your balloon? First and foremost, I couldn't get past the shoes. Like, they squeezing your feet, and it's like they're suffocating. Uh, I just couldn't get past that. Okay. For me, another thing, the physical attraction just mm -hmm. wasn't there for me. Mm -hmm. Like, wasn't my speed. Like, when I look at something, I want to be like, oh, I got to get that. Or right. I, I need that. And it's just right. like, oh, huh, next. Mm -hmm. So, like, the attraction wasn't there. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. So is Ricky someone that's your type? I mean, he's cool. Okay. Cool? You got a strong face. Oh. I love it, though. You mean like his jawline? Is that what yeah. you mean strong? Oh, mm -hmm. okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> you should eat a lot more, but I love it. Thank you. Appreciate that. Mm -hmm. And you are beautiful as well. Thank so you. I never thought I wasn't. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Let's go on over here to our next guy. Your name and age? Trey, and I'm 29. Okay. And Hello. Trey, why did you end up popping your balloon? Kind of like what my boy said down there, just a neck tattoo. I don't really like it. So everything else is perfect, though. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Tattoos. Yeah. <laughs> I love them. They're my favorite part about me. Yeah. yeah. Unbreakable. <laughs> oh, is that what that says? <laughs> yes, it does. Oh, yeah. okay. You cool, though. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So he's cool. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Let's go over here. Hello. Your name and age. Timothy, I'm 37. Okay. Hi. And Timothy, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, just not attracted. I don't like the tattoos and the leg. You got a leg tattoo. Um, Aw. I just don't see myself having fun with you. Like, okay. I wanna, I'm looking to have some fun. Right. And I uh, just, I don't know. Just okay. Just ain't a little, the weight, you're, you're kind of overweight for me, okay. too. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. So is Timothy someone that's your type? No, he looks his age. Oh, he does look like he's 37. It's okay, though. Okay. He's about 9, 10 years older than me. But I do. You... It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Let's head back. So we do have one unpopped balloon. All right. Um, any questions for each other? Yeah, how many kids you got? I got three. <laughs> okay. Kids obviously are a deal breaker. But before that, is she someone that's your type? Yeah, she look good. You know, I like the tattoos, uh, you know, that's look, they look nice. But Thank you. Just the kid is my limit. I ain't gonna Thank lie. You. Can't, can't even lie to you. That's good. Mm -hmm. Now, is Cedric someone that's your type? No. Okay. What makes him not your type? The way he looks. <laughs> I'm not trying to be funny. He's just not my type. Not for oh. real. So when you say the way he looks, like his the face. outfit. Oh. 
I'm good. He's fine. Okay. All right, cool. Thank you. Okay. Don't, don't laugh. Please. You're making me laugh. I'm no, trying not to. <laughs> he should be the last person laughing on this stage. Oh. Yeah. Who? The last guy? Yeah. Why are you laughing at him? Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, that is all the balloons, Pops. Bobby Doo, thank you so much for coming thank on. You. Let's go ahead and give it up for her.